We've got some more wooden clogs. And apparently you get a bad end, well maybe not a bad ending, but it's... From what I read from this walkthrough, when I initially played the game, it wasn't a good idea. Oh god. It wasn't a good idea to... Nice! Damn, that didn't actually do that much. It's not a good idea to collect a bunch of gummy frogs or gummy worms, because that gives you... I don't know, it, it cancels something out or something or, something or other. I'm not entirely sure what. But I don't really care at the same time, so... I'm just gonna play the game how I wish. There we go. And I want to collect gummy frogs, because it makes the game more... Not enjoyable, it just makes it easier if you always have a healing thing on hand. But the cool thing is, you can just run out the area, run back, and they're all back. <laughs> Including the acorns, I think. Which you do actually need. Not acorns, pine cones. You need them to unlock fast travel locations. So, I may just have to go off... Maybe not off screen, but... Just collect a bunch in my own time. That does barely anything. Oh dear. That did four. How much does a kick do? Six. Boosh. There we go, we leveled up. Woo! Level two. Yeah, pine cones. Picked up a pine cone. I'll get this last gummy frog. Boom. And then we can get out of here. I'll go heal up. Because I might need to. Actually, I don't think I do. I've got 20 health. Yeah, I think I should. Just to be safe, you know. Yeah, we've got these, the magic ones. Magic pot, you may drink my magic oil in exchange for one green frog. I have 11, no. And when we get pistachio on our part, or in our party, whenever we use a water pot, we recover gummy frogs from them. Not like the same one, it has to be a different water pot, I'm pretty sure. Maybe it's like every new water pot you come across. I can't remember. Here he is. And he's in front of like a mole rat thing. A demis. A demis. I'm in trouble, I'm trapped. I'm playing dead, but I'm done for if it sees through it. <laughs> Good timing. I was about to fight this monster, let's fight it together. Sure. I'm going to beat you up. Awesome. Pistachio's not that bad, honestly. His, his moves aren't the greatest, but he isn't that bad. Sure. Whee! Boosh. That does eight. And how much does it do for me? Seven. Wow. Yeah, this, e this one's actually really very easy. I'll just hold X so it skips through the animations. It's quite cool that if you... Well, not X, it would be A, I think. It's quite cool that if you do hold it down, it just skips through doing the animation. It's pretty cool. I love how they like a balloon. I'm alive! By the way, where are we headed now? According to my nose, Arancia is somewhere west of here. I also smell gummy frogs to the south, so we could go catch gummy frogs first. Speaking of which, I'm good at finding gummy frogs inside healing pots. With me around, your journey will be much easier. You suck, though, Pistachio. You really suck. Formation! You're going on the back row. Yes. Wow, perfect. The only reason he's off on the back row is because then he doesn't get attacked. He can only get attacked by magic. That should kill... no. Seriously, it left him with 1 HP. That means they have 18 HP, I think. Bum. to bum. One thing I don't like about this game, if I had to say anything, is the fact that if you go on your status, it doesn't tell you how much XP you need. Or maybe it does. No. It's like, you level up when the bar is filled. Thank you. How helpful. Right, I'm going back to the healing part. To heal up, but also to show off Pistachio's ability. I'm pretty sure it comes into play with this. HP recovered. There you go, there were three green frogs. Three green flo th flogs. Flogs. Frog's in the bottom of the pot. Sweet. It's really, really useful. I will admit. Right. Um. Wooden clogs. Either you. I'll just give him whatever. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. And yellow worms. Uh, recover magic. Like, they recover the MP. It smells like trees around here. 
It's really nice. It's a really nice smell that makes me all happy and excited. There must be something around here. Let's search around. Oh yeah, it's, he's on about the the grass spirit because his grass spirit is around the place. I'll kick because my electric doesn't do anything against this thing. That only did two. Oh dear, that was bad. Wow. Never mind. Sweet! Ah. Okay. You found a sticky. I'm the tree spirit, that's what it is, not earth. Tree spirit sticky, pine cones are my siblings. Please give me some pine cones. Give him one. Thanks, you're a good fella. You became friends with Sticky the Wood Spirit. I'm going to read the explanation, but if it's the same as Zappy, I'm not reading any more explanations. You can just call Sticky to summon Sticky. If you summon Sticky, the power of wood magic is doubled. It's wood. That's right. Yeah, this is not any different. I don't know. I know how to use the magic call Sticky. If I use call Sticky during the battle, the Wood Spirit Sticky will be summoned. With Sticky, the power of wood magic got, will be doubled. Got it? Yes. Yes, you understood me. I did indeed. And we gained back the pine cone we lost. I think that's actually put there on purpose. Whoa. These are good frogs. A blue frog. They recover 100 HP, I think. Where the gummy frogs only recover 30. I can't catch these. Ah, oh, fuck it run around spamming. Uh, I should probably use magic. And then I'll just kick it. Wow. Jesus. I don't think any of these enemies... Oh no, these enemies all do have elements. I don't know what the hell I'm on about. There's another... It's the fact I see them running around and I know I can grab them. So it's just like the urge, I suppose. I have to grab them. Uh, I'll try punching. I'll just... Yeah, do this. Oh, is that going to even work? Nope. Because it's got 9 HP. Stupid thing. I blame you, Pistachio. You suck. Yay, there we go. What's in the chest? A vinyl shirt and a magic wrist. I'm pretty sure they're things I already have. There we go. They are things I already own. Okay. Yes. And there we go. More green frogs. We get so many. It's good to have an abundance of them. Because then you can use the magic pot. I am sick of that shite. No, just trying to catch green frogs is not easy. It's such a pain in the butt. Right, can we actually kill this? No. Damn it. Pretty sure people on the back row take less damage from everything anyway. I'm almost certain. That's all I hope for anyway. Ba -ba -da -ba. Yeah, screw that gummy frog. Okay, we have a lot of stuff we still need to cover. Like, to explore and stuff. I'll use this. I have 23, so sure. Yay! Just keep using the magic. Fill up the magic meter. I'm pretty sure the higher your magic level gets, the more spells you start to learn. But I'm also sure we don't learn any new spells for a while. My magic is now level 3! A pine cone. Three wakey tails, which I'm assuming wake up people that go asleep. A bandana. I think that's different than what I'm using. No, it, never mind. Okay. Bam, bam. Okay. Just the usual. I should just skip the animations. The battles go a hell of a lot quicker when you don't see the animations. We got a blue frog from that thing. Jesus. Ah, here's the guy that allows us to fast travel. Pizza. Let's teleport. No matter where you are, you can, I can pull you out of my silk hat like a rabbit. If you pay me five pine cones, I'll register this as a warp spot. Once this is registered as a warp spot, you can warp here no matter where you are. 
To warp, first select all files in your menu, then select world map. Align the quill with the place you want to go, press the A button, and you'll warp there. Do you want to register this warp spot? Yes. Okay, this warp spot is registered. This is a present from yours truly. A map of light. So we got a map of the world. Look here, it's a hole. There's an entrance to a cave. Arantia is in there, we have to go inside. Sure. Yes! Cool! I'm so excited. You just can't hide it. You're about to lose control and you think you like it. Why do I do this? Over here, come over here. Arantia, something's strange. Yeah, something seems very off. And there you go. Down there, that little skull. That's Inky, the dark spirit. And the reason he spawned is purely because we spent... Wait, what do I keep... What do I go on to figure out, like, my equipment? No. It's not equipment, is it? Oh, yeah, it is. Shit, my bad. There we go. Sweet. Yeah, because we picked up so many gummy frogs, or caught so many gummy frogs, it caused Inky to spawn, I guess. I think it's if you catch six gummy frogs, it causes Inky to spawn, which... I have no idea if it's a good or a bad thing. Oh, they're fire? That ain't good. Oh no. I forgot the bite of that thing sucks. Ooh, its magic went down. And it died. Hang on, we got a Vox coin. Trying to remember what the hell that thing's used for. No. <laughs> Stay too close to that, and that would be a bad idea. Tulip hat. Makes my speed go down by one, but my strength goes up by two. Uh, it goes up by one. My defense all goes, also goes down by one. You can have the tulip hat. Because that just makes his... That's actually really good for him. His speed, man, it's crazy. I'm trying to wait for that thing to dis not disappear. To spawn. I want to catch it. Give me that gimme worm. Fuck, fuck, fuckity, fuck, fuck. God damn, that's why you don't sprint. I think it's a bad idea. Nope, there you go. I'm also appear from the hole. Yep, that happens. <laughs> right, don't try and separate who I go for. Just go for the same guy. God damn getting hit by both of those ain't good. I'm I do have like healing items, so I don't know why I'm that bothered. Right, there's one. Although I will admit, the holes that the gummy worms come out of, or hide in, are very useful for grinding. Because you can just go through over and over and over again. Pretty sure if you just stand next to the hole. Oh, never mind. Yeah, if you stand next to the hole, or just wait for it to go back into a hole, then it'll just do the same thing. Rinse and repeat it. Right, I think this is another Vox coin. Oh no, Ignis coins. What's the Vox coin used for? I don't remember. So you're catching green frogs isn't... You don't get penalized for it, which is quite nice. Right, give me that. Wait, does this... Fuck. That re heals. It tastes like lemon. Mmm. Lovely. Actually, yeah, here we go. Heals 30 HP. It heals 120. Wait, it tastes like apple. And tastes like soda pop. I'm not gonna lie. If frogs and worms tasted like either of those, then I'm pretty sure they'd probably all be dead. And the world would be really fucked up. You just grab a frog and fucking nom on it. I've noticed that his acorn is like taking them down. Like their magic power is going down crazily. Yes, please. There are no frogs. There's a tour shirt. Lovely. That's really good. Yeah, I can't give him that. Oh, right, here we go. His, uh... Toasty, that's his name. Hello, I'm the fire spirit Toasty. This is a sudden... This is sudden given that we just met. But, could I have two Ignis coins? Sure. I don't see what else I'd use them for. Thanks, we're friends, aren't we? Yay! No. I don't need to. Right, we've already healed up. Uh, this is a boss fight. 
So, first things first. I could save state, but I might as well just do save file. It works out probably better than a save state. And I can't remember which one the, the button is to save state, so... Yeah. We've managed to slip away from the Enigma's grasp. Arantia, what's wrong? You have a weird look in your eyes. Outside in the light, you might be able to escape from an enigma, but to chase your friend into the dark here, you sure are confident in yourselves, aren't you? 